Hey guys, it's iTech of the week, and today I'm going to be showing you how to install a semi untethered jailbreak on iOS 5. Alright, guys, so a uh, semi untethered jailbreak, what the difference between a tethered and un a semi untethered and an, an untethered jailbreak is uh, the tethered jailbreak, whenever you turn off your device, it won't even allow you to turn back on, it just boot loops. Uh, the semi untethered, which I'm going to show you what this is, uh, you can turn it off and back on, but anything related to Cydia uh, won't work, uh, and along with anything related to Cydia won't work, it also. Uh, Safari and Mail won't work. So Safari and Mail won't work, and anything related to Cydia, like Winterboard or, or Tweaks or anything like that, won't work, uh, including Cydia apps. Uh, and then the Untethered Jailbreak, when you reboot, everything just works fine. Now, the Semi-Untethered Jailbreak, because it allows you to boot back up, you can listen to music, you can uh, check any app that you downloaded from the App Store, you can, like, like Twitter, anything like that you got from the App Store, you, that, all those will work, so uh, you're set there. So it's a lot nicer than Tethered Jailbreak. Um, along with you, maybe if you accidentally just turn off your iPod or something like that, or iPhone, whatever you have, if you just accidentally turn it off, you, you're able to get it back on and you just and do whatever you need to do. Uh, but let's I'll show you how to install this now. So that, that's the differences right now. Uh, and to get the uh, the stuff to work again, uh, to get the stuff in the semi untethered jailbreak to work, like Cydia stuff, uh, when you turn back on, you'll have to uh, run Red Snow back in that uh, the just boot mode like you normally would with a tethered jailbreak. Uh, but so it, it at least starts up though. This some untethered jailbreak is a lot nicer. Uh, you're gonna have to add a source though. If you scroll down here, uh, you'll see if I bring this up to the camera. It says uh, right there, the big boss org slash semi tether. Uh, so it's that's what you add right there. The source right there, the big boss org slash semi tether. So you're gonna add that, and then you hear the only thing in here is semi tether. So you're gonna go ahead and select that. And uh, I already have it installed. Uh, if you can hear that thunder, sorry, there's a thunderstorm going on right, right now by me. Uh, anyway, you're, so you're going to hit modify, and uh, you're, I'm going to hit reinstall, but you, you're, what yours will say, it'll say install, so you're just going to install it, and uh, most likely, I think you'll have to do a reboot. For some reason, it makes me a respring, uh, but after you install for the first time, it'll say uh, reboot. So you guys have to do a reboot right away. Mine will be a respring, but, but uh, I'm just going to go ahead and, uh, and s reinstall this so you guys can see how it works kind of. So I'm going to go ahead and restart my springboard. And then while this is restarting, I do want to say that you do have to be jailbroken with the newest Red Snow. I was jailbroken with Red Snow 0.9.9 Beta 5, and uh, this did not work. Uh, if you jailbreak with Red Snow 0.9.9 Beta 7, which is the newest one available for Mac and Windows, uh, that'll allow you to. This, this semi tethered jailbreak, it will work. Uh, I got a video tutorial on that, so I'll put an annotation. Uh, actually, I might just have that going throughout the entire video, just so you can uh, click on that. I'll probably put it in the upper right or something like that, but you'll see it. You'll see the annotation. Anyway, so you can see right now everything's working, themes and everything. I haven't turned it off my device yet. But if we slide down here, I'm going to go ahead and reboot my device. It's power and reboot. So I'm going to try not to cut anything out of this. If it's taking a while, I might cut a little bit of this out. But uh, but uh, let's wait for this to reboot now. And it, it, I think it does take a little bit longer than normal. Uh, but it does reboot. So I'll be back actually when this finishes up. So it booted up now, and you can see that uh, the, fir the first thing that happened is, well, I don't have a theme on anymore. I just have this normal wallpaper and normal slide unlock. Everything is designed the same. Uh, I had Infinity Dock on. You can see if I'm scrolling right here, it doesn't do anything. It's not moving. Uh, I, ha I had Barrel on. That's not working. Um, my icons are all out of order. So you can tell that it's it restarted, though. I'm on a tether jailbreak, and it restarted. Safari, we tried that. Closes out. doesn't work. Mail. Uh, it just stays in this screen, doesn't do anything. Cydia, go ahead and open that up. Doesn't mean open, doesn't even go to the white screen. But now here's an app that I installed from uh, the App Store. So go ahead and open that up. You can see this one does open and does not crash or anything. It's taking a little bit though, actually. But there you can see this app does work. And just now what app will do, uh, the music app. So. You can't see uh, the music app and everything works fine. Uh, so you can start it up and you can, the only, you just can't use Safari though, so that's kind of down, no internet browsing, uh, but everything else should work. Uh, messages, let's see here, uh, that loads up. So everything does work except for uh, Safari and Mail and city related things. Uh, also, to get everything to run back to normal again, you will have to rerun Red Snow in the just boot mode. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and show you that now. So guys, you can't see I got Red Snow Beta 7 here. And here's my iDevice, uh, same state as it is before, just rebooted on that semi untethered. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and register and hit extras, just boot, and we're gonna go ahead and do DFU mode. Uh, on the computer, this is what it says right now, it just tells you to enter DFU mode. 
uh, and it kind of explains to turn off your device and hit next. Well, we're going to do DAC mode right here just because it's easier. Uh, and you'll see exactly how to do this in my jailbreak tutorial if you, if you watch that before you do this. Uh, but so, power and home button in 10 seconds. 3, 4, 5. And that's about 10 seconds now, so I'm going to release the power. It doesn't have to be exact, guys. Uh, it, I would count 10 seconds just to make sure. Uh, watch like a clock or some seconds or something like that. Just make sure you count 10 seconds. But Red Snow has uh, recognized DFU mode and it is doing the just boot. Uh, the device, white screen, waiting for the reboot. That's what Red Snow's doing. Black screen. And uh, it'll boot up like normally. Once you see that pineapple logo, I will end this video. Patching files. Waiting for boot. Rebooting. And done. Pineapple logo is there. We're set. Now when this boots up, uh, everything will be good. And uh, you're set to go. And uh, again, so you can shut off your device. You got that semi tether uh, installed now, so you can shut off your device and everything will work except for Safari, Mail, and CD related things. Uh, until you boot up with Redstone and just boot. And all that stuff will return to its normal ability. So that is it, guys. I want to go ahead and uh, show you this video. And also, uh, subscribe up top. And uh, to be notified when the actual untethered jailbreak is released, I'll uh, have coverage on that. So go ahead and subscribe up top to be notified and make sure uh, you don't miss that. And you uh, that way you, you'll be updated whenever you're maybe updated and know for sure that the untethered jailbreak is out. You can also follow me on Twitter uh, to get tech updates and all the other good stuff, the untethered and all the other information. I'll also, that's another way I'll be able to notify you. Uh, so you can go ahead follow me on Twitter. My username is also uh, the same as my YouTube username, iTech Every Week. So that's it for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed the rest of your night, and I'll see you in the next one.